South Korea revised its vaccine campaign goal for Q2. Authorities feel it is possible to deliver first doses to 14 million people. Lee Gyeong-un provides a closer look. 99 days into South Korea's COVID-19 vaccination campaign, it seems like the country is on course to achieve its goal of giving 14 million people at least one dose by the end of June. As of Friday, around 7.1 million people have received their first shots. And there are more than 7.6 million people who have booked their vaccinations for this month. That's about 81 percent of those eligible for this round, the majority being senior citizens aged 60 to 74, with the rest being dialysis patients. In addition to these people, some 900,000 military-related personnel have been added to the second quarter inoculation campaign. They'll be getting the J&J &J vaccines. They're scheduled to arrive early Saturday morning. With the addition of the Johnson & Johnson inoculations, we can give first doses to more than 25 percent of the population by the first half of this year, which can bring us back to normalcy earlier than initially planned. The plan is most likely to be realized as so far 99.8 percent of the registered recipients have actually showed up for vaccination. That means not that many vaccines go wasted. But the government is trying to make sure no doses go to waste due to people not showing up. Previously, these so-called no-show vaccines were available for anyone over 30 to apply for. But starting Friday, those over 60 will get priority for the leftover vaccines as part of the government's efforts to vaccinate the most vulnerable. That has been the priority for the first 100 days of the inoculation campaign and will remain so for the next few weeks. Young-un, Arirang News.